female cop humiliated by male cop? What? What's up, princess? <laughs> oh, did you get lost looking for the little girl's room? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right next to the men's room. Boys. Uh-oh. Oh, careful, boys. I think she may be PMSing. <laughs> okay, princess. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, yeah! Yeah, get him! Nice, Frank. Good takedown. Now, now kiss him on the See, mouth a little. You gotta be kidding me. You only spar against a woman? Yeah, how am I even supposed to do that? What's wrong with that? It's impossible. Don't break a nail or something. <laughs> Had enough, princess? <laughs> All right, that's enough. What stunt team did they get to choreograph this? The John Wick team? That was nuts. It's like I watched the real fight. You should be making us all coffee instead. <laughs> Damn. Get us all another cup of coffee. If that's all you hey, wait a minute. Thanks. Get us all. That's the bully from the Sniper Wolf series on the Darman in the Darman universe. So he went from bully to nice guy to asshole cop now. So he's he's like he had a character arc and now he's reverting back. Damn. I had such high hopes for him in season two. Another cup of coffee. No janitor is when he was the nice guy. Your only job is to make sure my cup stays full. Understand? You're right. How much coffee does he drink? <laughs> Damn, the Darman budget is wild. There's police Everyone cars? Knows women can't drive. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Get in the passenger seat. Y'all probably just drop her off at the nail salon and meet up with you boys. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Ooh, that's a good idea, Omni. That's right around the corner. Let's go. Sunset Overdrive, huh? I'm familiar. We're on the way. Damn, he's busting it. It isn't safe for you. Stay in the car. <laughs> yeah, let me handle this by myself. Oh God, no, not the. What a takedown. Police, don't move. Why'd you do that? I had the situation under control. It looked to me like you needed help. Just go back and wait in the car. This is a man's job. Hey. Okay. Oh, good work. Expertly done. This is the most action I've ever seen in a Darman video. Let's get some more drama. Turns out this is his dad. said I had it under control. Yeah, right. What did he even steal? Good thing we got him. Idiot farm. You guys bag Ronnie the robber. And on your first day, too. Been after this guy for months. Yeah, <laughs> that's what you get. I didn't try very hard on that one, Darman, but I I like it. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> what is it? Go get me a fresh cup of coffee. Ooh. While you're at it, get Allie one too. You better get used to it. She's your new boss. Damn, she got promoted to sergeant on her first on, day. Let me show you your new office. Ronnie the robber must have really been like prestigious. Oh, Wait, what was the message there? Hold on, shit. So you see, whatever men can do, women can do, if not better. A am I an idiot or is that like, is that grammar like super fucking wrong? What is, whatever men can do, women can do, if not better. I know what he's trying to say, but that has really confused me to like a really high degree. Car mechanic tried to scam a woman. It's been an incredible few Steve! years, man. Thank you, Oscar. You earned that. Give my love to your wife and kids, okay? Oscar! Fuck yeah. <clears throat> Very kawaii wow. toolbox there. Look at all these... What are these, anime waifus? Nice, I like it. I like it. So to shatter your dream, but that manager position's mine. Pretty soon I'm gonna be your boss, so you should get used to taking orders from me. You know what? Start by throwing that away. Okay. Fine, fuck it. And one of you check it? Yeah, not a problem. I'd be happy to. Just go ahead and uh Lo siento, but no. We don't fill air here, Paco. I'll check it for you. Okay, just pull your car in. Thank you so much. Are you just gonna ignore all that? Why don't you just beat this guy's ass? <laughs> like are you just gonna brush that off? See this? <laughs> this is exactly what? why you'll never be a manager. You should never judge a book by its cover. <laughs> Well, how about also don't be racist? Like, 
The message here is more than just don't judge a book by its cover, it's don't be racist as well, I think. Like, it's getting overshadowed here by a different message. Well, I know as a woman you probably don't know much about cars, but take it from me. This could be very serious. <laughs> oh, I actually know a lot about cars. Just because you found some inspo on Pinterest doesn't <laughs> mean you know about cars. This would be the worst <laughs> manager of all time. Just, sweetheart, just pull it And by that I mean the best. He's doing great. Okay. It's my daughter's. I have a business nearby. Sure you do, Hector, and I'm the CEO of Tesla. <laughs> Why don't you just beat that man's ass with a tire iron? Like, what? Why are you just like? <laughs> Right. Darman really doubled down on making them assholes. How much do I owe you? 60 oh, no, grand. Don't worry about it. Here at Chris's Curry Purse, we believe in always treating customers like family. Yeah, clearly. So I'm not going to charge you like, for a little bit of air. You, like you heard my racist uh, co-worker, God right? bless you. I'm definitely coming back. Why? 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 One nice employee and a genuine racist. It doesn't, Chris's like, neutral here. out. Just go somewhere else. Like, are you hey, what's oh, up? Man. Welcome you back. slut. So you need me to fix your car? You just give me the key, I'll give it a full inspection. But that's really not necessary. Doesn't matter. What do you know about automobiles? Carburetors. Pistons and shit and shit like that. She doesn't know the brake from the gas pedal. Take it from me. Yeah, women don't know what gas on the floor means. Oh boy. Am I glad you brought this in today? Yeah, this car was about to explode. It needs to be replaced. What? That's crazy. It was running perfectly fine. So maybe, yeah, a, a woman doesn't know what perfectly fine engines sound like, unlike me. Thank you for me. Unbelievable. When a car's spark plugs are bad, it can cause the engine to misfire. Uh oh, I'm getting a lesson now. We'll trick needle nose pliers, please. I don't know what that means. Hands are a hammer. Damn. See all the oil and oh, deposits? gross. That means it's time to replace it's it. It's the worst butt plug I've ever seen. Watch. The car blows up. <laughs> this is the catastrophic explosion. See? No check engine light. You're a coward, Darman. Take it in an action. Subverting expectations direction. But I don't understand. How do you know so much about cars? You see, I own this place. Say my dad owns a shop. Christina! What are you doing here? Ah, uh, just getting sexually harassed by your employee. Wait. She's your daughter. Yeah, yeah. She actually used to work here back when Oscar started. Leroy here tried to charge me $5,000 to replace my entire engine when all I needed were some spark plugs. You what? Uh-oh. Caught red-handed. So, uh, I can explain. You see. Oh, boy. Wow, wow, that is a nice Porsche. I'd like to donate $10 million to this car repair shop. Hey, Sam. I told you I'd be back, and this time, I brought my car. What do you think something like that would cost? I'd say get the fuck out of here. We don't do that. I don't know. Off the top of my head, around 10 grand? That sounds great to me. Let's do it. Okay. He just fucked him. Wait, that's a, ter that's a terrible price. What? That's way too much. He just fucking scammed them right in front of the boss. Looks like you just won the contest. Congratulations. You're the new shop manager. Can we fire the racist guy too while we're at it? Like, what it- no, That should serious? be step one. You're fired. Ah, uh, there we go. Go ahead. See, at this shop, we, we treat em. everybody like their family, not take advantage of them. You got me fired. Thanks a lot, sweetheart. Holy shit. What'd you just call her? Uh-oh. Sweetheart. Why? Who are you? Her husband. He just rips his head off like an action figure. It's weird because Darman does those and has one message. Don't judge a book by its cover. Message being, she's a woman, you, you shouldn't assume she doesn't know about cars, so you can't scam her. Or he's not driving a nice car, so he doesn't have money. But then he also litters the character with racism. And that's never addressed. It's not like, don't be racist. It's just, hey, just because he's driving a bad car doesn't mean he's broke. And just because she's a woman doesn't mean she doesn't know cars. Like, I feel like that should have been a double whammy of a message. TikTok famous teen kicked out of office. I have a new marketing idea. Oh, it's called OnlyFans. Let's go! Woo! In the newspaper. Now we're feeling it. 
Barb, nobody reads the newspaper anymore. Well, let's not get carried and away. that would probably cost us every penny that we have. Hey, thank you for the 10 gift subs, Mike Troy. Barb, it's time that we try something new. We need to get with the trends. That's ridiculous. And to help us out with our marketing. Yeah, I don't know TikTok stars. Allison Day. She's She's like the Han queen of Hanks. TikTok. Hey, what's uh, up? It's a pleasure to be here, and I can't wait to work. <laughs> Fifteen-year-old high school talk tick star going to solve all of our problems. Hmm? I'm actually twenty. Ooh, blasted! You see, <laughs> you have a lot of experience. She's like Cruella Deville. Darling, old is gold. No one has we ever said that. Full page ad Ever. in the newspaper. Mm, so prime goal. Sorry about that. I do not know what has gotten into her. Please don't mind her. I, I'll talk to her later, okay? It, it's okay. No, just fire her. Just or I'm out. Fucking hardball them. What is the message here? Hire TikTok stars to be your marketing you managers? I'd love to. So. Hey, speaking of which, can you shout me out on your TikTok you know, channel? The oldest gold lady. Oh gosh. That's Barb. This whole thing is just Darman justifying <laughs> online influencer marketing to his audience. <laughs> nice, Darman. Fuck yeah. Okay. Okay. So, I, I, I'm, I'm too deep into this one. I need to see how this ends and what the message is. Hey, Darman fam. To all the CEOs out there, consider using TikTok stars to pump your products. I'm going to show design you can contact me if you'd like. I actually own an agency. So use Darman agency to... Uh, reach out, I guess. I don't know. What's going on in here? Oh, um, we're creating a TikTok. Here. A what? Check it out. She just melts. Well, how, this how is... was your big idea. Yeah, I mean, it's not a good video or anything. I suppose the phones will just magically start ringing. What's your guys' TikTok? Oh, we actually don't have one. What? Don't have a TikTok? Ah! Ah! Wasting our money on that. It's free. No cost. It's free. This is an advertisement for TikTok and for influencer marketing. If after you know, I, I think I'm just going to leave. Why? Who cares? I feel really bad. You, you're you a fucking TikTok superstar. You make a million dollars a week off sponsored posts. What does it matter what Barb thinks? Uh, Allison? You're above this, Allison. Allison wh where, where? What did she say to you? Please. She said that lip syncing on TikTok isn't talent. Truth. Old is gold. <laughs> Don't forget that. Do you even know what the definition crab. of insanity is? Uh -oh. It's doing the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. <gasps> if you keep marketing this way, you're never going to see change. Get blasted. Old isn't always gold. Sometimes new is what to do. Uh oh, Jesus. All right, never mind. You just lost credibility. Why do that? Allison. He's reset slug. Are you sure? The tier one no cry. Going to work. It's a free idea. It's a, a fucking free idea. All right then. Barb is preaching about buying a goddamn newspaper ad we for will give fifty Allison billion dollars. And if she was doing it on her own for free. Then it shouldn't take long. No, in fact, it can't take more than sixty Barb seconds. Leaves is out. When they finish recording, wow, look at that. Allison edits the video and gets ready to post it on TikTok. Check out Daisy's designs. Link in bio. Oh, genius. That'll okay. do it. That'll do it. Posting in three, two, one. So you're telling me that people on TikTok are just going to call the literal CEOs of this company directly? Wait just a minute now. That was so good. That was incredible. Amazing. Holy nice fuck. Job. But I don't hear the phones ringing. Oh. Well, don't worry. They, they're asking their parents permission to use the phone. They're children, Barb. Give them a minute. Oh. Oh. It's ringing. It's the Better Business Bureau telling them they're shut down. to call in Daisy Design Services. How can I help you? A telemarketer. Ah. Rats. Barb, it's I been five seconds. Right. It just takes time. It's Trust been five seconds, you. Barb. Any more time. Oh, oh. Hello, Daisy's Designs. How may I help you? 
I want fifteen million dollars worth of Daisy's designs. You want help designing your office? Oh, yes, absolutely. Elon Musk. Finally. Oh my God! Yes. No, that was us on Allison's TikTok. Hello, uh, Daisy's Design Services. Uh, How can I help you? Hello. So they can only ever get six orders at a time. How efficient! No wonder this company folded. No, there's six phones. There are six phones. I can count them. We are back in business. We what? are back. No, you have six orders. You have six orders. Let's not get carried away. Jesus Christ. Your idea? It worked. I mean, phones are ringing off the hook in there. Barb, again, I see why you are a shit marketer. There is six customers right now. We have six. Thank you for saving our company. No, it, Barb? Do you want to record a TikTok? Why? Why? Why would you say yes to that, Allison? What are you going to do with her? Give her a sponge bath? Like, what the fuck do you mean? Jesus Christ. Oh, now you become a full shill for Daisy's designs, huh? So you saved the company and tank your TikTok career. Where is Barb and what have you done with her? Oh. Barb is not here anymore. Now it's just cringe. What happened to We're posting cringe on Maine. That was good. Yeah. That was another fucking banger. <laughs> it's... I mean, I will say, though, at least he's not doing the same scripts every time anymore. He's finally started branching out into original stories. Like, this one had action scenes in it. Like, you know. He's on the come up. Pretty soon, he'll be directing... Full-blown, like, Taken movies. Poor student shamed for old clothes. What happens next is shocking. Is that last year's Animal Crossing what? t-shirt? You're wearing last year's Minecraft t-shirt. What do you what do you mean? No one plays Come on that guys. What? Oh true. So things have been here, Gordon. Here Mom, you're fucking what are you doing in the school right now? Let me know if you need anything else, okay? Jesus Christ. Gordon gets his clothes from the goodwill. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Isn't there poop on those or something? That's so gross. Oh my god. Oh, my god. Gordon. Goofy Gordon. Anyways, he check out the new iPad Pro my mom got me. Hey. That's fucking nuts. I can't believe people pay that for that. That's all my mom could give me, okay? You shouldn't even have a goddamn tablet to begin with. That's really mean. You missed tablet back. Be quiet. Oh, ah! He's going nuts. Gamer mode. A Minecraft stand is fighting on Twitter right now, live. Ah! Ah! You're nuts. Pure evil. Was that Darman laughing at him? Why was that such a deep voice laugh? Is there a 30 year old in this classroom somewhere laughing at Gordon? You guys want to come over? My mom just got me a PS5. Oh, seriously? Yeah, let's go. Cool, we can play nothing on it. Wow. There's one game for it. Gonna see this. My mom comes and picks me up in her brand new Porsche every single Darman loves Porsche. There she is now. Maybe he's sponsored by Porsche. Really good for you. Give me my keys back! <laughs> <laughs> sure. I'll give them back. Go fetch. <laughs> Why did you do that? Joey, I cannot believe what I just saw. We, we were just joking, Miss Henry. Well, joking at Gordon's expense is unacceptable, young man. You two, go home. Wait, isn't that his mom? Wait, isn't that Gordon's mom? What? No. We have to go talk to your mom. Please, don't do that. Oh, she's a teacher? Oh, I got that so mixed up. Henry, I am so sorry. Yes, I will have a talk with him. And make now sure you're going to have to get a job. Mom, mom. It's just good Will Gordon. It's not that serious. Not that serious. Will Gordon, who is that? Hmm. Just some poor kid everybody makes fun of. He wears old clothes, has a broken tail. Now she's going to start making fun of him. If you saw him, you'd laugh at him too. What? She just starts throwing eggs at him. No. Let me show you how to bully. How I We're rich. I'll never have to go through any of that. Not anymore. I sold my company to prove a lesson to you. And I gave away my money. It's because we from now on. <gasps> no new iPad. No new Minecraft merch? And you're going to bike home. <gasps> Why, you Whoa. can't do that. I just did. That's impossible. Everyone laughs and makes him feel really bad. That's it's a terrible tablet to be fair. You deserve to be made fun of. Unbelievable. Blue? Joey's mom 
doesn't come to pick him up Unbelievable. in Porsche. He now realizes how much it hurts to get made fun of. That's some shitty ass friends. Later, he has one week where he doesn't have a lot of money and they fucking hate him. Can you please forgive me? No. Well, Forgiveness is weakness. Now you can beat his ass. Sure. I forgive you. Gordon. A Minecraft t-shirt? Minecraft merch? I've always wanted one of these. My, you Minecraft so merch? You're welcome. Huh? And, uh, oh my god. Do you want to come over and play Roblox? Ro no. What? No. Uh, Minecraft. I'd love to, but you're welcome. And your mother is now employed at my mom's company. Should I meet you at your place? God. What a turnaround, huh? From a shitty iPad to a new iPad. From an Animal Crossing t-shirt to a Minecraft shirt. Holy shit. Spoiled son doesn't want to do chores. Thanks to Prime Zacaroni. You didn't take out the trash last night. Oh, <gasps> Fortnite? Alex! Shut the fuck up, you old hag! You trash last night. Whatever, Harpy. I'm busy. Pay me first. Oh, good business. <laughs> you know, I wish someone wow. would pay me for making breakfast. Why would anyone pay you? <laughs> That's your job. <laughs> Mother, you're so silly. Uh, you filthy harlot. Why would you get money? <laughs> oh my god. You make me laugh sometimes, but you make me sick. So get the fuck away from me, Mom. Just died. Thanks a lot, Mom. Thanks, Mom. You ruined my chances of making it to phase now. I only get paid to take out the trash. If you want me to do that, then you're gonna have to pay me more. This guy Alex, knows what he's doing. If you're going to That's do business. Something, you can't... Oh, Jesus Christ, you almost killed her. What are you doing? And why are you playing with Legos? I'm gonna get the Disgusting. Door. Get it? Not even sirloin and shot of royal. Oh, or chateau. Can I help you? What the fuck is it called? Hi, dear. What do you want him to do? Eat it? Got a bad back and it's hard for me to bend over. Oh, boo hoo. Alex, did you leave Max's poop on Miss Johnson's lawn? No, I took a shit there because I don't respect her. Close the door. She doesn't pay me. On people's front lawns. What are you, the poop police? Shut, shut the fuck up, Mom. I'm trying to eat my hash browns and plastic eggs. Now, can you give me the ketchup? Oh, not part of her job. That's not part of my job. You just set the rules and you're not playing by them. Max, what are you doing? Mom decides that she's gonna give her son a taste of his own medicine. Man, this whole house is made out of marble. Nice. Okay. Go ahead and wash one. Not my job either. So another place just never get washed. Clothes, by the way. From what I remember, it was my job to do the laundry. Oh Nothing boy, else. she is fucking rolling him right now. Oh, and I'll leave my clothes over there. Doesn't bother me one bit. You're playing hardball right now, mom. Who's going to break first? Playing against what the bots. Heck? Did the power just go out? I mean, it's your job to pay the bills. I'm also never gonna buy food again, and we'll starve because it's not my job. Cook you food. I like it. Laundry and pay the rent. Yeah. Anything about electricity bill? Stop it, mom. How am I supposed to play my game? What are you gonna cry? You're gonna cry? Funny. Idiot. You're just gonna fucking tear up over there. I'll be in my. Get a job. Well, that is pretty impressive. Now, can you please pay the electric bill? No, we really can't afford to. Like, I like actually, we can't. So, just get used to living like this. I'll fold your clothes, though, I guess. That was the message? If you're gonna do something, you should never do it halfway. I, I, didn't, I didn't get that at all from the video. Huh. Well, I mean, I guess. Though, I guess you could spin the message the other way, like... If you're gonna do it, go all in. Literally drive yourself to poverty to prove to your son that he's an asshole. No reason for half measures. 